Question 34. Yeah. The routing table uses the longest prefix match in its routing decisions. Longest prefix rat, uh, match, and this is the routing table. What are the next hops for each of the following two destination addresses? One of the destination addresses is 196.94.10.7, and the other one is 1.196.94.10.7. Dot nine. Now, for 196.94.10.7, um, what's the next hop? Well, this address would have to appear in the range of one of these addresses to go to this particular next hop. With the longest prefix match, we use the most specific address if there are two of them that it fits in. So now let's take a look at these uh, addresses here. If you're not familiar with CIDR notation, then I want you to take a look. You probably you want to look this up on Wikipedia or someplace. CIDR notation is um, one way of shortening uh, the description of a range of IP addresses. Now these are all IPv4, uh, version 4. V6 also has this too. There's another chart for that, but let me just show you V4. This is what it looks like. Um, you can kind of see, uh, well, I guess you can't see too well, but basically, uh, the larger the number is here, the smaller the range of addresses. In other words, the larger the range of the prefix that it covers. So this, when it says 196.94.8.0, slash 21. What that means is the first 21 bits in the 34-bit IP address belong to this prefix. The rest of them are free to be, you know, are, are, are the rest of the range. So, for example, here we have 38.9.211.0. The bits would be like they are written here. And slash 24. Now slash 24 means if you have a 32-bit address minus 24 bits for the prefix, that's going to give you how many? Eight bits left over, right? These eight bits are the bits that would be arranged. 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, all the way to 255. So, so like for, exa for example, for this one right here, we have a 196.9410.0. This one gives us a range of 2048 addresses. So 2048 addresses is going to be 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. It's going to be 8 of these. So so this is going to go all the way to um, 15.255. That's that whole range from here to there. Because this, this one gives us 32 minus 21 is 11. 2 to the 11th is 2048. 2048 addresses. So this range here is 196.94. This slash 21 is a shorthand for giving that range. For this one, it would be less. It would be, um, let's see, I, I wrote it down here. Uh, all the way, it would be, this is 24, so this would go to 255. So this, this part of the prefix would remain the same. And then for the, for this one, it's 16, which means that these last two would completely change. So this would go all the way down to 255, 255. So now let's see if this helps us figure out the answer here. The next hop for 10, it, it would fit in here and it would fit in here. But we want the longest prefix match, so that means uh, we choose the more specific one, which is S. And uh, for this one, we have 196.94.34.9. There's only one of them that it fits in, U. So the answer to question 34, the answer to question 34 is B. This one fits into S, the next half is S, and this one the next half is U.